Hong Kong's government has formally withdrawn a controversial extradition bill which sparked months of anti-government demonstrations. Hong Kong's chief executive, Carrie Lam, announced a decision to scrap the bill in the last few minutes. And the law would have allowed for residents to be extradited to mainland China. Protesters said it posed a threat to the territory's semi-autonomous status. Let's now go uh, to RDW's uh, William Young. He's standing by in Hong Kong. William, what is the latest on Hong Kong leader Carrie Lam's announcement on this extradition bill, which, had, which is what triggered these protests in the first place? So as we know from several local news sources, Carrie Lam started this meeting with pearl Beijing lawmakers and also other uh, top level government officials since 4 p.m. And uh, she is expected to announce the uh, plan to withdraw the bill formally uh, in the next few hours. And uh, as we know from uh, some Hong local Hong Kong source, uh, news sources, uh, it's likely to be announced through a TV announcement rather than a, a press conference like we, what we have seen in the last few months. And how are the pro-democracy movement leaders reacting to these developments? Will the withdrawal of the bill lead to an easing of tensions? So the organizers of uh, several of the million people marches in Hong Kong and also the prominent activist Joshua Wong have both came out and uh, say that this announcement came too late. And uh, they also, the organizer Civil Human Rights uh, Front also said that, described this as a uh, Amazon fire, which means that uh, there's no way for them to really uh, stop the uh, protest movement completely with just simply this announcement. And you mentioned Joshua Wong uh, William. He's a prominent pro-democracy activist. Now, he's written a letter to German Chancellor Angela Merkel today asking for help. What do the protesters expect from the German Chancellor? Uh, so as we know, Hong Kong protesters have been very good at uh, rallying support from international community. And they have been using every chance they can to really get the attention from world leaders in democratic worlds. So uh, as Angela Merkel is expected to make her trip to China in the coming days, uh, Joshua Wong used this chance to really uh, call out to her and then ask her to uh, raise the issue of Hong Kong and the situation of Hong Kong uh, during her meeting with uh, Chinese President Xi Jinping. And any word from Beijing on these latest developments in Hong Kong? We haven't really heard any uh, official words and uh, responses from Beijing. But uh, as we can, uh, as we know, Beijing's uh, sole mission is to keep Carrie Lam in place and then keep the Hong Kong government in place so that the Hong Kong society can still somehow remain in a stable manner. Uh, so. We, I, I assume uh, we can expect some formal announcement or responses from uh, Beijing in the coming days. Right. DW's William Young in Hong Kong. Thank you very much for that update from there.